Hey folks, it's Greg and Janet, and today we're in Quitman, Texas, and we're going to do a drive around the town here and check out what it's like and tell you a little information about the town. Right here in front of us is Quitman High School. This is the high school that Sissy Spacek went to when she lived here. And Quitman was named after John A. Quitman, who was a governor of Mississippi, Mississippi and a prominent figure in the Mexican War. It was incorporated in 1941 and today it has 1,942 residents. The town sits in Wood County, Texas, in East Texas, in the Piney Woods. They got a true value here in Quitman. Being in East Texas, you'll probably see lots of churches. <laughs> it's only 10 miles north of Mineola, which we go through there all the time. Mm -hmm. Texas Farm Bureau, we use them. <laughs> Here's like a middle school or... There's your first church. There's a church. There's another, you know, you're going to see them. That's an elementary school to the left. They discovered oil around 1941. And that's when the population jumped. There's lots of lakes around here. There's a bass champion that lives here. Bass got the biggest bass in Lake Port or something like that. <laughs> Hospital over here to the left. Another church. Church of Christ. We got a hospital over here on the right. UT Health, East Texas. Coming up here on the left is the childhood home of Sissy Spacek. Got a construction truck out in front of it today. I'll turn around so we can get a better view of it. <laughs> phone booth. <laughs> yeah, you don't see those often now, do you? <laughs> it's right up here on the right. With the white truck. All right, we're heading over to the town square here. All these East Texas small towns seem to have a town square. Here's the hospital to the left. We just passed it. Care flight. This seems like a really nice town. They actually have a Ford dealership. The Brookshire's is a local chain. Well, they actually have stores in Louisiana and Arkansas too now, 200 stores. But Lake Fork is very close to here. got a Sonic, Jan. Cool. They've got all the fancy modern restaurants here, don't they? Fire department, city hall. Look at that building down there. Classic town square look. Yeah, I bet that's the courthouse. Wood County Courthouse. Shops all along the way. Yeah. Barber shop. Don't see many barber shops anymore. That's just what I was thinking. Coffee house. 
That's a speakeasy coffee house. The tattered lounge and listening room. Okay, so we're taking a break here in Quitman at the Speakeasy Coffee Shop. And I was looking online to see who else was famous from Quitman. Of course, there's Sissy Spacek, but there's also I'm a Hog, which the first time I heard of I'm a Hog, I thought it was a joke, but it's not. She was a philanthrop philanthropist, and we actually visited her property in Mineola in another video. And then there's also Thomas Marrow Reevely, who was a senior United States Circuit Judge of the United States Court of Appeals for the Fifth Circuit. He lived to be 99 years old. There was a uh, baseball pitcher named D. Sanders, and he played, uh, played ball he would have played in the 1940s with the St. Louis Browns. So there's a few famous people from Quitman. Mm -hmm. Town of only 1,942 people. Okay. So, That's pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. so. <laughs> but anyhow, we're in this really cool speakeasy coffee shop. And it's really nice. Yeah. We both got hot mochas. Yes. And they're fantastic. Yes. This is the and cheaper from the big yeah. store. Yeah. Shop local. Help your local communities, folks. It's really good. Mine's delicious. Well, we're going to finish up our coffee and we're going to get back out there and take a look at some more equipment. Awesome. See some of these shops. Jokers. Oh, yeah. Sidekicks, Texas Family Restaurant, Dandy Sidekicks. Lots of lawyers around the courthouse. Yeah. Uh -huh. Historical Commission. Tree. Well, this isn't really a town square. It's kind of a. It looks like a town square when you're coming into it, but. Town Square. What is Peoples? 30 minute parking. Peoples. I don't know what it is. In Texas, every town that has more than 100 people has a nail salon. Yeah. <laughs> Where is it? Veteran Services. Driver's license. Awesome. I just got passed by a big old truck. Yeah. Yeah, tractors. You can see lots of tractors in this part of the country. Vape shop. There's always vape shops. Every town has one now. Now the church. Two churches. Okay. Oh my. Beautiful country out here. The church. East Texas is known for sand and red clay. A lot of it out here. It's a beautiful day. We're in the 80s. Here we go. Welcome to Quitman. Founded in 1850.
Best tacos, breakfast, and lunch. Yeah, at a gas station. It may be the only taco place in town. There you go. <laughs> antiques are big in East Texas. Yes. Badewater is known for their antiques. In Texas antique capital. That's the second donut shop I've seen in town. <laughs> donut places are thriving. Look at this old hotel, motel. Yeah. Looks in pretty good shape. Another church. Senior activity center. For every young activity center. Gas ain't cheap right now. Seems like every small town has an O'Reilly's or maybe an AutoZone. O'Reilly's is popular. Nice park on the right here. That is nice. Uh huh. Mexican place, Peraltas. Pizza place. There you go. Dairy Queen, of course. Look tremendous. We got barbecue, burgers. Nice little town. Yeah. See if we can't get off the main road here and find a residential area and show you some of the houses. Okay. Another church. I saw a Baptist church back there. Yeah. There's another Baptist church, yeah. I can't pull over here and turn around. Yeah, we're at the edge of town. Yeah, there's another equipment sign right there. Yeah. Every home on that street's painted white. Yeah. They say we're, we're running out of land. You got lots of land here in Texas. Oh wow, that's a nice lake back there. Wow. These are all in the water, huh? Yep. Oh, nice. Hmm. Is it a private drive? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Not today. <laughs> it's pretty neat See back if I here. I can't get down to where that lake is. I think it's right there. There's a dock. Water looks low. A little bit. Yeah, they got everybody's got their own little docks. That's so cool. Chicken coop. Yeah, that's a nice one. No garden. Can't wait till you get ours going. It's so cool to go through these back roads. It's a nice home on the right. Yeah, it is. It's lovely. Gotta have a porch. Very nice area.
Sissy Spacek Drive. She has a street named after her here in Quitman. Alright, we got the back side of a building. Church. Church. A church. church, yeah, right here. First Faith Baptist Church. Here's the cemetery on the right. A couple houses. That's some kind of farm supply store on the left. Bells of hay. That type of thing. If they were going to name the town after a celebrity, you'd think you'd give them a more glamorous street. Like one of them right in downtown or something. But it is what it is. Yeah. Gas station. There's a Edward Jones. All right, guys. Well, that's Quitman. A little bit of the town. Showed you some of the neighborhoods. It's a beautiful area. Um, and Home of Sissy Spacek. That's right. Right. So, you guys, well, thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button, the like button, the little bell, and all that. Have a blessed day. Strange RV tours will take you places With Greg and Janet's smiling faces You might see a crazy flavored soda review Or some tips to fix your RV too So come along, won't you join us, friend As we discover what's around the bend Just sit right back in your easy chair Strange RV Tours is on the air Strange RV Tours is on